Thank you, Mr. Speaker. This is the bill we discussed at length yesterday. And briefly, it adjusts school start date, student progression, progress monitoring, reduction of duplicative and excessive state assessments, flexibility in teacher evaluations, flexibility for local assessments, and teacher quality. And that is the bill. The purpose of this is for us to continue improvement. And that's what I will continue to do until I leave. Chairman O'Toole has done a good job in putting this together. And, and believe me, she did not do this in the, in the comfort of her four walls and her corner office that she has. She did this by going out to the school districts and she did this by listening to parents and she did this by listening to teachers. Each and every one of you have the obligation to go back to your public schools and say thank you. Because these people work hard every single day to help our children. In a state of over 19 million people, we as legislators, along with our governor, Senate partners, and Commissioner of Education, DOE, and all the many staffs, set out to create the best educational opportunity for Florida's future leaders. All of this collective effort to prepare them to be ready to accept tomorrow's challenges. It is with respect and passion for the process that I ask for your favorable support of this good bill. Clerk will lock the machine and announce the vote. 115 yeas, zero nays. Show the bill passes.